I'm not going to lie, this is an exciting time of year for us. It's the time of year where our kids uh, work month after month uh, for this time. And uh, needless to say, there's a lot of excitement in our gym because of that. Uh, we're coming off uh, a successful 2008 season, and uh, looking at it, we lost uh, six players from last year, um, some to graduation and, and some for other reasons. Um, but that also includes uh, two uh, first-team all-conference players, Ashton and Amy. Uh, and when I was, looked back at things, uh, they basically provided 90% of our offense last year, uh, which is a pretty significant amount. So uh, what that means is, is we have a lot of holes to fill on the offensive side of things. And um, the good part is we have a lot of kids that are, are working hard and wanting to uh, prove that they can be the people to fill those holes. So we're excited about that, and we've been hard at it since the 9th. Uh, we have been uh, doing two-a-days with an activity at night, uh, so we have uh, really worn them out physically, mentally, and probably a little bit emotionally some days, um, but we know that it's, it's making them stronger, uh, both as individuals and as a team. They're having to come together and, and figure out ways to get things done. So proud of their effort uh, coming into preseason. We were really excited about the intensity, um, the effort. We even feel like technically they were probably a step ahead of where we thought they would be. Um, the one downside of that is uh, as we progress throughout the preseason, probably the last six or seven days, uh, we've had quite a few people out uh, with some injuries. And it's amazing uh, when you have only 15 kids and you have anywhere from three to five people out and you're a fairly young team, uh, what a difference that can make in uh, what you do in practice. And I am proud of our kids. They keep the intensity level high. Uh, they're really working hard. Um, but it's hard to, to get the kind of training that we want to um, just because we have um, some people in positions that we really need out there that are out. So we're practicing some things that, as coaches, um, we hope we don't have to get to when we're actually competing against another team. Um, but if we do, you know, we're going to be ready for it, and our kids uh, will be experienced with it. Um, we have a good core coming back. When you look at our roster, uh, we have one senior, four juniors, uh, two sophomores, and eight freshmen, uh, including three redshirt freshmen. Uh, so we're pretty young, but I like the core we have coming back. Um, so we're excited about all of them. Ellie, Shannon, uh, Beth, Michelle is considered our core that's coming back. And obviously we expect them to step it up and, and play even bigger roles than they did last year. Um, more production on the court, more leadership, especially uh, throughout these first few weeks when some of those new kids are definitely going to be getting their feet wet a little bit. Uh, we had an awesome trip overseas, which I'm sure many of you know about. Uh, great opportunity to go over and play in Italy and Prague, um, Slovenia. Uh, just a great opportunity for uh, our kids to not only get some experience, some of those younger kids that haven't seen the floor in a competition-type setting, uh, and also a nice experience for them to really bond together.